everybody and welcome to a new episode of Solo Choco Kid and Zed! We continue our Venus Go series! We saw the classic Jigs 12 taken from the Great Mazinger series and today we will see a model taken from the manga Mazinger Angels inspired as we already see from a television series of 70s Charles Angels and obviously from a many Gona Guy series, robotic and not. But the main inspiration for this manga are the female models of Solo Chobokin, as the author explained. And in fact, we see in many draw the button for launch the missile, as we see in the model. However, we will see Aphrodite and Diana take from this series, and today we'll see the third of the four Mantinga Angels, Venus Ace. Jigs 12 and A, full and more and more of purpose weapon. Roll the video! At the box GX12 MA Venus Ace 2004 model, box in line with the other Mazinga engines, with a marble background and with the color of the model, in this case red orange. Model on the cover posing similar to the GX12, but reverse it with some crazy weapon in the background and a B side of the robot elegantly covered by the hand with a reflective inscription Mazinga Angels Venus Ace. Top left, the logo of the Mazinger Angels manga. On the side, we have the logo of the Mazinger Angels, a art with the wings, almost like an ice cream logo. <laughs> the Solo Choco King logo and the model name. Above and below, the same information. Let's turn the box, we find the same image of the weapons that we saw on the cover, but with the true color. We have OPM, OPI missile system, the missile system of the chest, 02 drill pressure missile that uh, goes at the speed of Mach 4, like the information say, and they can cross the herd. These missiles are practically the missile from the Grandizar Spacer. We have OPM-07, that is the Mazinger blade, with the information that say the chest, in reality the tit, gets open and of stuff appear. <laughs> no, 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 better call it handle, the stuff can be something different. <laughs> <laughs> Pulling the handles appear a sword made with a super alloy Z, practically the sword of the great Mazinger, but lighter, super sharp and the surface shiny like a mirror. The other weapon is OPM-05, her teeth turn into a big Venus Typhoon fan that can give off a wind that can cause a tornado with a 4 km radius. By pressing the switch, this very powerful wind can become a tornado of hot air that can reach 40,000 degrees, or the blizzard smash, the emission of a cold air up to 180 degrees below zero. At the top right, the three robots, Mazinger Angels, Minerva X will be added later. Spoiler alert, oh damn. <laughs> I should say spoiler before say the fact <laughs> and not after. <laughs> I'm sorry. And below the three robot with the three palos take from the maga. We open the box and we find the robot, the queen stars, one set of antenna, one set of close hands, one set open hands, one set of ends in classic pose of finger missile, one set of uh, plates to simulate the end of missile, one set of missile boobs, one Mazinger blade, one set of drill missile, one stand up for the display with a blade holder, one set of Venus Typhoon, 
one display, one name sticker for the display, in this case ready apply. Here we are the extraction all in color with a marble background that we already see in the box with the same image as the code. The dimensions are the same as the GX12, but having a large model image, the GX12 give an illusion the extraction are larger, but they are the same dimension. Let's open them and find the contents of the box, the virus function, and how to assemble everything. That's all! If you think it's not too much, you should see the next week robot. <laughs> Here we are at the display of the GX12 MA Mazinga Angels Venus Ace. The display is very simple and it's practically the same display as GX12, which was the same as GX08, which is the same function. We can add the virus end and weapon. Here the sticker name already applied in this case below is empty. We add the stand up with the support belt for the robot, we add the support for the sword. Let's quick compare with that one of GX12. We see the base is the same, the stand up is taller because the Mazinga engines are more taller having heels. The stand up also a mounted backboard, just for change a bit. <laughs> And obviously we are no longer have support for the Venus Crander, but for the Mazinga sword. Here we are the Pilder, the Queen Star, which is a practically the same as the GX12 but with a different color. Let's compare them and see the glass is no longer blue but blue gray and the body is not pure white but a fire red, the color of Venus Mazinga Angels. Side we are now have the yellow color and the reactor are all red except the final part which are silver and the red is also the central theme. The rear grid now is darker. I must say now it has become a Ferrari of the star. <laughs> I like this color. However, we know the coloring is very rough and not too well applied. Evidently, June has distracted the mechanic, who will not be. <laughs> Let's move on to the Venus Ace GX12 MA Mazinga Angels robot from 2004. This is how it come out from the box and some parts must be add. The tits, that is the Ophai missile of course. Let's add the hands, we need I just add the Ferrari, it. I mean the Queen Star and the antennas. Here it is, let's go and see it. The body, arms and legs are all in metal. The head is a rigid plastic and a soft plastic the ends. We see the detail of the tattoos, the logo of Mazinga Angels in the Ad Dome, in the legs the hearts, Algida. <laughs> At the rear the usually agri screw and the bottom for the launch of Opai missile. And obviously the written made in China 2001, exactly like the GX12 and the GX08. We see the joints, that are the those of GX12, very articulated. We can rotate the body a bit, we see the head. They can be tilted and rotated, very possible. The arms are super articulated like the legs, exactly like the GX12, almost a FA full action model. The antenna are made of soft plastic and they are the most annoying things, even in this model. They do not stay attached very well. Let's change the virus end and add those of the finger missile, super classic pose for Venus robot. Like all female robot, we can shoot the missile, have to say that's the any Venus Ace has more sex appeal compared to Aphrodite. In plus, we have a nipples. <laughs> Not a small detail. <laughs> We add the new weapons, precisely OPM-02, which are the drill missile, all in plastic, beautiful, large, similar to the weapon of the Spacer of Grandizer, but more pervert. <laughs> we add OPM-05 Venus Typhoon, a plastic block with the shape of a large fan with many details, but without too many joints. Of course, these two can be fired. Let's look at them very closely. Not a big uh, melon, but too big fan. <laughs> 
it reminds me a lot of a car engine of the TV series Machine Hayabusa with those turbines. <laughs> Here they are in combination of OPM mix. The last weapon is an OPM 07 that is a Mazinger blade. As I said, this comes from the breast. Obviously, beautiful sword like the one of Aphrodite A, Mazinger Angels. Obviously, with the Mazinger Angels logo, the art with the wings. Let's compare it with the GX12. Have you see the GX12 MA is more tall because it has the classic heels like all Mazinger Angels. We see the different coloration. The white has become a chrome and the red more orange. The joints golden chromate, now silver. The breast had turned from a pastel yellow to a golden yellow with the orange reflection, all chromate. However, we see the body is exactly the same. In fact, the both models are made in China 2001 and we have the rear hole for the Venus Scrander, even if the GX12 MA does not have Scrander in the box. But you can add that from the GX12. In fact, also in the Mazinga Angels manga, Venus can fly. Even the hair can be raised and house the scrander. As far coloring, the hair are more opaque and lighter. Let's look the face, it's become more android, it has less olive color, now it's more silver, longer, and with a more in arrow eyes, almost like a classic representation of alien. the final part with the comments and the price I will say it's a robot from 2004 all through it has not been as successful like the other female robots in fact it is easy fun second hand but also never open at the price around 6,000 yen it is 19 New Zealand dollars 60 euro more or less I must say the GX12 is more fascinated uh, perhaps more for memories but also a coloring I find it more fascinating I must say all the weapons of Mazinga Angels are interchangeable which each other obviously have the same body and attachment of OPM and they are very funny and rich of a usually Japanese genius and perversion which I and I made you love too <laughs> more to have it in the collection if you want to finish the Mazinga Angels also recreating pose take from the manga about them later I'm happy to have them but after this video I will put back in the box obviously lack of space I prefer to keep the GX12 on the wall however next week we will go to see the latest Venus Ace always take from Mazinga Angels manga and we will talk about the GX12 MAG. Queens of Gold always here at Solo Chokokin and Zach.